So I'm going to now show you the on pin pressed command, which you can find within the input command set. We can choose any of the large pins on the bottom of the micro bit. We can see them here, pin 0, 1 and 2, and they're available in this drop down menu. So I'm going to leave it on the default with pin 0. And what happens here is, if a user was to hold the ground pin with one hand and touch pin 0 with their other hand, thus completing the circuit, the code within this block would then execute. So we can, let's try a show icon command and put that in here. So now if this pin is pressed, and to simulate that simulator we just have to click that pin, the code within this block will now execute and we'll see this icon. So let's try that out. There we go. So we can see this is coming on. So this is quite useful for making touch interactive uh, products with the microbit itself.